Hello, hello, Leos. I hope you're doing well. I am doing okay myself. I have been taking a little bit of a mental health break the last couple of days. So um, just hanging in there, doing what I got to do. I hope everyone is in great spirits. We're going to go ahead and see what is what don't you see coming. This is uh, unexpected messages, unexpected blessings, whatever is coming through for you, Leo. Um, I may extend this reading. I'm not sure if it looks like it needs to be extended, then I will. But if not, then we're just going to, you know, keep it going here. Okay. So make sure that you comment, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. We will be doing our live stream. I promise. I know I said it, I was going to do it, but I promise, uh, we will be doing it for July, the month to come. So it will be done before the end of June. Okay. So, uh, thank you all for being patient with me. All right. So your card is the angel of love. Okay. So maybe this message will pertain to love. We also have the angel of balance at the bottom of the deck, which I see that as like the justice card. So some things may be improving for you in love. There may be some contracts that pertain to your love life. This, you know, contracts can be buying a home together. It can be a marriage contract, technically, right? It will be like a soul contract. So let's see what's happening for Leo. What do they not see coming, Spirit? Unexpected messages for the sign of Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. So we have the Strength card and we have the Chariot, okay? All right, let's get a couple more cards. Some of you could be dealing with a Cancer or another Leo. I also feel like you're going to surprise yourself with your resilience, Leo. You're going to surprise yourself with how you're able to overcome some obstacles in your life. Uh, some of you, you may be getting a new car or fixing a car. So there could be improvement with a car situation. Uh, something that you didn't expect here. Just saying that's, a, that's yeah. Some of you, you're going to uh, surprise yourself with how you overcome an obstacle, okay? That's been put in your path and you just like demolish it. And, and that's really good. So this is like coming up in the next week or so with this uh, seven of wands. So there may be something that presents itself in the next seven days. Um, it's like an obstacle or a challenge and you own it completely. You're like, you know what? I'm not even worried about it. I'm gonna get through it. So any blockages that may come up in your life, any, you know, um, like standstills or anything like that, you will overcome it. So don't worry. All right. I also feel like for some of you with the emperor here, you either block someone or someone may have blocked you. Um, or there has been like a standstill in a connection so far. And I feel like there could be a development with that. So for some of you, the unexpected thing is somebody that you have blocked is going to message you maybe on another platform. Uh, maybe for some of you, they may even come see you with the chariot. So maybe some of you guys will block somebody and you're not expecting them to come see you. I don't know. Uh, that may not be for everyone, but for some of you, that's going to resonate. I'm also getting, like I said, for some of you, it's a relationship overall. You've been experiencing blockages with this person. It feels like this person's been stubborn, you know, not really willing to change. And I feel like you're going to see some developments with that, the chariot, like them overcoming whatever obstacles are blocking this connection, which is most likely pride um, with the emperor here, okay? So let's see, what else wants to come out for Leo? What else wants to come out for Leo? Let's see what else wants to come out for Leo. Unexpected messages. The Six of Cups. Yeah, it's definitely something coming from the past here. And I keep getting this energy of like things that were stuck moving forward. So this is like communication. This is writer's block for some of you. Creative blocks. Money blocks. Like there's the chariot is the star of this reading. Uh, yes, of course, the strength card. Don't get me wrong. But with the chariot in the middle with the strength card, that's a that's a crazy energy right there. The chariot and the strength card together means that there is nothing that can stand in your way. OK, and like I said, for a lot of you, this could even pertain to a person. Um, you could even like feel destined to never be with anybody. Some of you are like, I'll never meet anyone. Uh, you've been feeling blocked in your love life. And then you meet someone who could be an air sign with that king of swords. They could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Uh, they could be a Pisces, Cancer, a Sagittarius or a Capricorn. But that's another unexpected thing for some of you. So I'm just channeling different messages here. Uh, the main message, though, is is improvement, development. And it's quick, too. The Ace of Wands and the Chariot is saying that something improves rather quickly, like within a week. Some of you maybe within a day, like an obstacle pops up and you get out, like you're like, nope, not even having it today. 
and you and you own it. So um, overall improvements. I feel like this is financial and in love. Okay, and this is unexpected to you because for some of you, you've been like I just heard all my life I had to fight. So some of you, you've been like in the thick of it. You're just like you know what this is what it is. I'm gonna have to keep dealing with this. I'm just gonna have to keep you know fighting my way through. And then all of a sudden, you're gonna feel like things start moving in your direction, moving in your favor. Okay, this is like the wheel of fortune energy almost. All right. Yeah, the two of wands. So I'm definitely getting like the past no longer being relevant here. So uh, if you have been wanting to move, uh, if you've been wanting to change jobs, like I said, if you've been wanting to let go of an ex and move on to someone new, all of those things are being highlighted here. So like I said, forward progress is the unexpected message. And I feel like it's unexpected because some of you may have been got kind of got like jaded or you may be a little bit pessimistic right now. You're just like, I'm not going to see a way out. Like we're, you know, like some of you don't see a way out and there's a way coming. All right. Uh, with the seven of wands here. So let me see, what is this blockage? Why is the seven of wands in the hangman here? Can we get more about this? The ten of swords? Yeah, it's something that needs to end. Now, this could be on your side or someone else's. So if this is a love situation, this person could need to end a situ you know, a relationship or whatever in order to be with you. Um, or this could be, like I said, a job change. It's going to be different for everyone. But if you have been kind of feeling like things are not moving forward, it's just been stuck. Some of you are tired of your job and you want something new. I really see positive developments for you, Leo. Changes, okay? And like I said, I think what the message is, the unexpected part of it is how quickly this happens. Some of you are expecting something to go on way longer than it is. It's not going to go on as long as, as you think it is. Or you're at the end of it. Like you've already went through the thick of it and now you're... You're coming out of this. And we've been getting this message for you, Leo. So um, it's a nice little quick message. I'm not going to extend this. I don't feel like it really needs to be extended. Um, I will do another reading tonight. So I will post another one that will have an extended. Let me know if you guys want an 18 plus extended for the reading tonight or if you just want a regular extended. I always love to hear your feedback. Uh, thank you so much, Leo. Make, make sure you comment on this video because I am posting it at a different time than I normally do and the algorithm does not like that. So make sure you're commenting and I will see y'all tonight let me know what you want me to do a reading on i don't really have a subject in mind so let me know if there's a specific thing that you want to hear from me all right i love y'all and i'll talk to y'all soon peace